Hello lovely people. Welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before it's lovely to see you again and if you're new here then welcome. My name's Sophie and it's a great pleasure to have you company today. So I've got an unboxing of a mulberry piece. Um, this is a wallet that I purchased to replace um, the Darley folded wallet um, because in the end I sent that back because I didn't like it. Um, this is the exact same uh, layout on the inside, it's just slightly different on the outside. So all I've done, this was actually an online purchase and Mulberry uh, send their products out in these bags um, inside a cardboard postage box. So all I've done is taken, opened the postage box and taken this bag out and this is exactly how it's come. So you can see it's been really nicely tied actually. So I think they like you to sort of experience as if you would have been to the shop, um, which is nice. So I haven't seen this yet. Obviously this is a genuine true unboxing. So let's go ahead and get inside. So it just has the normal mulberry ribbon. I think it's, is it gross grain, cross grain? I'm not sure of the word. That's how it's come, wrapped in tissue, that's lovely. So we've got, I guess, the return information in there. So I'll put that out of the way because we don't need it. And then nothing else left in the box. It just has the, the normal uh, writing uh, in the bottom of the box. Uh, sorry, in the bottom of the bag. So I'll pop that out of the way. So that's the tissue paper with the mulberry tree. Knocking the camera with the mulberry tree. Which is lovely actually. And then that's what the box looks like. Again, it's just a normal sort of standard generic mulberry box, nothing on it. I hope this is okay. Because of course you, when you order them online you can't, you don't pick it do you, somebody else does. So, so that's how it's come, again with the mulberry tissue. You can see the difference already between the Darley wallet and this one here. It's the same colour. So I already have this exact wallet but in the colour chestnut. So I know that I like it. And originally I'd bought the Darley wallet, which had got the little turn lock here that stuck out. Um, and I bought that because it had a black interior. And Mulberry have another version of this wallet with the press stud um, and the round flat button on the front that had um, almost like a burgundy interior. And I didn't, the cats just jumped off the bed and got onto the windowsill, so. Apologies for the camera movement. Let me just see if I can, yeah, sorry about that. So as I was saying, um, they have this color already exactly the same, but it just has a burgundy interior and I didn't like it with the pink. Um, I have actually, I'll show you the color that I'm talking about. So this is a mulberry purse. Um, and that's the color that the interior is. And against the black, I think it looks beautiful, but against with pink, I'm not really sure that it goes to be honest so it put me off from buying the original version of this so i was looking on the website the other day and happened upon this one um and it has a black interior so i'm hoping that as we look around it it turns out to be okay and that i can keep it because i don't really want to go to the trouble of sending it back to be honest with you so that's what it looks like it has the mulberry tree in the press stud and as I said I've got this exact wallet in chestnut that goes with an Alexa a mini Alexa bag that I've got and then on the inside just get rid of the card gorgeous black interior and it just has the gold foiling there with the mulberry tree and it has the billfold 
and six card slots and then under here and then under here you've got extra space and then on the back again it's the exact same layout as the dolly that I had with the turn lock but it just has a press stud instead which I prefer because I was just a bit concerned with that other wallet that eventually it would catch and that the gold colour would wear away and then also I was concerned that it might catch on my other items and you know perhaps damage things so that's what it looks like anyway and it's a small grain leather, which, I, you know, I prefer on small items over the heavy grain they call the other version. So, yeah, this is really nice. I think I'm going to keep it because it's really nicely made. The leather's nice. It's a good colour. I just forgot to point out there the Mulberry branding, Mulberry England. And I just prefer it over the other one because it has a flat button here. And of course now they've done a version with the black interior. It's absolutely perfect. So the original Dali that I have got a video of, um, I did an unboxing video of that. Um, that one went back because it was faulty. There was a, it was puckered here. And then I got a replacement, put all my stuff in it and then didn't really use it that much. I used it for about a day, I think. But there was no cash money in it, it was literally just my cards in there. And then I saw this on the website, so I sent the Dali back and purchased this. So I really hope that this was helpful for anyone that's interested in this wallet. I hope it was enjoyable. And as always, guys, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Take care. Bye bye.